sweet, sweet Zoe that I love. From the very first moment that I laid eyes on you, it was love at first sight. From the moment that I read how you described yourself, it was koi no yokan. What does that mean? Keep reading. The feeling like you're destined for one another. I'm still that same Josh that is head over heels for you, like when we first met. And I so graciously stood up and walked away, forgetting my jacket. <laughs> yeah. All of this leading up to our date where we first shared a kiss and a wedding duck came out to tell us our future. I hope I make you feel these things too, because you deserve all my love and more, and more than anyone else on earth. You are my home, my happy place, my breath of fresh air, the smell of the earth after it rains, a warm towel straight from the dryer, a hot cup of coffee on a cold autumn day, every sunset, every sunrise, and every twinkling star in the sky. You are my everything I could ever love. Even when you have stinky farts. <laughs> All right, and how did you and Josh meet? Um, who's Josh? Well, I, I was in the strip club. I had $5 in my pocket. Walked up to the first girl I see, the most beautiful girl in the world. I said, what can I get for $5? And I got married. <laughs> just kidding. I just wanted to say that. You can put that in, that question. No, me and Zoe, we actually met online. Um, she, uh... She blew me away because I, I, when I first saw her, it was just love at first sight. I just had butterflies in my stomach. And then I took some time to get to know her and what she had to say about herself. And I just absolutely loved everything she had to say. We met for the first time at the hookah bar because I was about a year sober and I didn't want to go to like a bar bar. So we met at the hookah bar and I was really, really nervous. And um, I had a lot of, I think I had like three monster energy drinks. And so I was super hyped up and excited for him to get there as he finally showed up. And then um, we had a really good time. I don't know how many hours we spent talking, uh, but it was really fun. And then when the night kind of winded down and it was time to leave, he got up um, and walked right, right out the door. So I was like, okay, thought it was going really well, guess not. We're midway into a conversation and I just stand up without even, yeah, just stand up without even saying anything. And I just walk and leave without saying anything to her, no goodbyes or nothing. And then I, I, you know, I'm outside thinking, why did I just do that? Like, I'm an idiot. And then I was like, oh crap, forgot my jacket. He comes running back, um, grabs the jacket, apologizes, and then is like, why don't I walk out with you? I was like, okay. It just, yeah. So that happened. Um, yeah. And then it was kind of, I mean, here we are today. So, and then the second day, um, yeah, you know, I had to, I had to let one rip in front of her because if a girl can't stand me, uh, you know, farting, well, it's not gonna work out. So uh, she passed that test, and um, yeah, I guess you could say that couples that fart together stay together. So <laughs> he turns to look at me with his eyes, you know, all he's like, I have a secret. And my first thought was like, he has a fart, doesn't he? And sure enough, he's like, I'm like, oh, what's your secret, you know? And he's like, I have to fart. I'm like, oh my God, like, of course, you know, I'm like, just let it out, it's fine, I don't care. Like, it's so embarrassing, you know? So he just, yep, just broke the ice right then and there. And I was like, okay, I guess we're comfortable together. <laughs> I knew Zoe was the one for me because... Oh, there goes the awkward silence. <laughs> <laughs> so I first knew that Josh was the one when we were at his apartment and, um, we were watching something dumb on TV and he looked at me and he goes, let's order pizza. And I just was filled with so much joy that I was like, yep, this is the man I'm going to marry one day. You know, I was like, I think I'm in love with him. I'm not somebody that likes, like, say you have to pass this test or anything like that. But I, yeah, I, I don't care about tests except for the fart test. That one's important. Remember that, fellas. <laughs> I, I think that from the beginning, I knew she was the one, but it was just growing to the point of, okay, yeah, we're actually gonna do this thing. We're gonna spend the rest of our lives together. And so, uh, so it's time to get fucking married. Let's do this shit. <laughs> Thank you.
On behalf of Zoe and Josh, I want to thank you all so much for being here today to celebrate their love and their journey together. Without further ado, I'll let them take the floor. I very humbly and very gratefully ask that you take me as your wife, as your spouse, your friend, your partner in love and in life. I commit my forever to you, embracing all sorrows and joys, enduring all hardships and triumphs, and showing up for you and with you through all experiences of life. I so joyously make this commitment to you, a song of love, a dance of faith, a warm hug of hope, and a pinky promise of unity made new every day. Please say you do. I do. <laughs> Zoe, I humbly and gratefully ask that you take me as your husband, as your spouse, your friend, your partner in love and in life. I commit my forever to you, embracing all sorrows and joys, enduring all hardships and triumphs, and showing up for you and with you through all, throughout all experiences in life. I joyously make this commitment to you, a song of love, a dance of faith, a warm hug of hope, and a pinky promise of unity made new every day. Please say I do. I do. <laughs> Uh-oh. I got it. <laughs> Thank you. Cheers to Mr. and Mrs. Supporta. And 
my love for him now extends to you guys. But uh, man, I hope you continue life with that same reckless abandon. And uh, welcome to your family, brother. Thank you. <laughs> No, but I, I mean, man, you're a genuine nice guy, and nothing but the best for my baby little cousin, who I'm going to steal a line from uh, Will, you're the first redhead I fell in love with. So. And I just, I really wanted to say that I'm so thankful for everyone here. I am. It's so nice to meet so many new faces and share, you know, share so many memories together. And I just, I love you so much, bro. I love you, seriously. I love you. <laughs> I was gonna be in the image, but I'm not. Your touch, baby, the way that your body is moving me. And I don't know where this all will go. Oh, no. Yeah.